I want to ask you, what is the state of the affair, the relationship between you and the United States at the moment? Well, we value the relationship with the United States. The U.S. has been with us on the fight against terrorism. Uh, they have helped us greatly. We appreciate all the support that they have provided, but we would like to see that commitment continues because we do see the threat of ISIS still very much alive. They're still out there. They are not only a threat to the region, but to the rest of the world. So that would require a much closer cooperation with the United States-led coalition. Has the relationship been hurt in any way about what's happened in Syria? Well, unfortunately, you know, we, uh, we're very concerned about the recent developments and what happened in Syria. Uh, we hope that that could be revised and somehow find a uh, solution that could uh, uh, take into account the interests and the well-being of the Kurdish people as uh, with the rest of the people that live in that area. And lastly, I just wanted to ask you, how serious is the threat of a resurgent ISIS in this region? It is very serious. Actually, we have seen a 300 percent increase in the activities of ISIS since last spring. Wow. That was before the uh, killing of uh, Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi. But that doesn't mean that the threat is no longer going to be there. We still believe that they are very capable of conducting terrorist activities in different parts of the country. And you're still working closely with U.S. forces? We are, we are working very closely with the U.S. Thank you. Thank you.